Archimedes' principle is the rule that the buoyant force on an object is equal to the weight of the fluid displaced by that object. According to Archimedes' principle, when an object sinks, the object weighs more than the displaced fluid. The volume of the displaced fluid is equal to the volume of the object. When an object is placed in the displacement cup, the water level will rise and the water will spill out into the container on the scale. Archimedes' principle says the weight of this displaced fluid is less than the weight of the object because it sinks. The volume of the displaced fluid is equal to the volume of the object because it's totally underwater, but that water weighs less than the object. This blue egg weighs 79.5 grams. When placed in water, it sinks and displaces its volume in water, which we can see is 60 milliliters. That displaced water only weighs 35 grams, which is why it sinks. Archimedes' principle says that if the object weighs more than the water it displaces, it sinks. When an object floats, the object weighs the same as the displaced fluid. The volume of the displaced fluid is equal to the volume of the object that is underwater. So here's an object, a 10 Newton object, that is floating halfway underwater. The object displaces water, which spills out into the container on the scale. Archimedes' principle says that the weight of this fluid is equal to the weight of the object, which is 10 Newtons. The volume of the object is equal to the volume of the object underwater. So a 2 liter object halfway underwater will push out 1 liter of water. But that 1 liter of water will weigh 10 Newtons. This pink egg weighs 22.9 grams. When placed in water, it floats and displaces a volume of water equal to the part of the egg that is underwater, about 23 milliliters. That displaced water weighs 22.9 grams, which is why it floats. Archimedes' principle says that if the object weighs the same as the water displaces, it floats.